You are right on time. I have just finished my preparations. If you want to teleport me to Sitarif, why didn't you weave that spell right in the fortress? <sighs> Your knowledge of magic is still very limited. Because of the obelisks, of course. We can't deactivate them without endangering the city. And their power would have interfered with my spell. We don't want you to land in a rock or even a mountain, do we? I see. From here, you can safely teleport me to Sitarif? Probably. Probably? I would have preferred a definite yes. I'm not a human teleportation circle. This spell can vary greatly in its range. But I can make sure you suffer no harm. How comforting. If you are afraid, then why don't you go stretch your legs a little? Just let me know when you're ready. Why didn't you go to Sitarif along with the others? If we had all run there, Thorniara would have been without protection. Milton was determined to go, so I stayed in Thorniara together with Medarian to support the king. What was there before the volcano broke out? A dense jungle, just like in the south of Sitarif, but the lava burnt it all down to ashes. I've just slaughtered a few wolves that were possessed by a kind of demonic power. Then it was them. What do you mean? Since the volcano broke out, I have felt a strong presence of the divine power of Beliar. At first, it was further away, and then moved closer. It must have been the wolves. And now you don't feel that divine power any longer? I do, but it comes from a distance. It comes from the volcano, and from the direction of... Satarif. Why do you always help me fight your own god? Do I? Yes. Well, it only seems as if I do. Let's not talk about it any longer. Yes, I'm... Just weave your spell. Good. In a few heartbeats, you will be in Satarif, or at least uh, closer to the town. Uh, before I forget, Medarian gave me this here for you. Perhaps it is of use to you.